little steps, really. So when it's 4.30, <laughs> I'd just like to know. Endure, endure, endure. Oh, ha. That's five. Oh, ma. Hey, uh, let's go, Tommy. Ah. It's up five, it's almost 5.20. Five five oh, jeez, that's easy. Okay. Get out of there. I ain't oh, been in a hut because that stings like a man. Oh. Look at Tommy. <laughs> I'm not making that mistake. I went straight in there after doing four and it felt like my whole body was falling off. And, oh. Mate, that's beyond red. I, I know. I can see. <laughs> Holy crap. It's worse getting out. I should have stayed in. <laughs> hey. My hands were getting it there like my fingers. That's sore than that. It's like I set myself a wee goal today is like 10 minutes. So I've been doing five minutes every morning after the Peloton bike. So it's just like, I don't know, telling yourself it's, it's going to be okay. If I get hypothermia, I get hypothermia and I have to get my fingers cut off and so be it. I'd actually rather go to jail than do this. Just leave me. Go back to Luke. Oh, something bad off. Nine minutes fifty. Oh, it's... Oh. Oh. Straight into your afternoon seal. No, I did it the other day. It was horrendous. <sighs> now we're smoking. That's the worst part, but if Luke comes in here, he'll think that it's hard. Because your whole body just goes in pain. Especially because you go in there for a minute and a half, you're like, oh, it's 10.20. Right, guys. I'm a bit cold. I have just done the cold water with Luke. I got like five minutes, which is a PV for me. Luke's a freak in the cold and he got... 10 minutes and he's just had a bath so uh, that's an absolute brutal thing to do in the morning got better things usually to do on a Friday but any, anyway so yeah had a lot of fun the last few weeks with Silverstone <laughs> uh, going to tennis Doing a lot of good cool things and now I'm gonna be just got myself a nice bath in the morning like I said and I'm gonna go down to the golf the British Open so um we're gonna go have some fun and then we're gonna get back to hard training next week Dan is coming up next week as well for a few 10 10 days so just to get the minds back into it and stuff obviously Luke's I can't really train with Luke too much right now with his injury so he's just doing his own thing so it's quite hard to get get the head in it sometimes for these bigger big sessions so yeah I'm gonna have Dan up and I uh, yeah, we're gonna get rock and rolling. So yeah, guys, enjoy and see you soon. So these are the lumberjacks. Got ourselves some New colours, new designs. I'll lead up, I'm with you. Nice and what? wet. No worries. <laughs> Take care. Yeah, I really like them. Uh, this is a, we took a gamble on this colour and, and it really paid off. 
Yeah, something a bit different, you know? Yeah. Need to get the stool for you, eh? I see. Who's taller out of you? Please. <laughs> I think Cam's taller with the hair. What, uh, what height are you kicking up? Yeah, I think you're taller. I don't know. I was I was six four last time I, got, I measured myself. Well, I didn't measure myself. But. <laughs> no, I don't know. You must be six four, six five. Yeah, six five. Yeah. 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 yeah me too. This is the gym session done. Our good friend and the uh, guy that's doing our documentary, Jordan Mulligan, he is attempting the world's heaviest marathon. So he's carrying a hundred kilo stone on his back in memory of his son, um, Jacob, who was unfortunately had, uh, he was stillborn when he was born. So really sad story. So we're gonna go and walk in the final couple of miles, which will help get rid of some lactic acid in my legs. So Jordan, we'll see you soon. Big love. Big tall bugger that he is. Is that the Tesla then, is it? That looks like All right, Tesla. I'll tell you what, I'll go and I'll just turn around. You got the other rig, do you? Yeah, I got the other rig. Well, he was falling around really well, <laughs> and then like, it seems like there's something hit. Like hit a wall. Yeah, hit a wall. How long has he got left to go today? Six miles wow. left right. from where he is Back at the moment. <laughs> Keep going, mate. I'll catch up with you. Don't stop. We're having a bad day, man. We've got you, mate. We've got you. Keep <laughs> going. Keep going. I'm going to get up with you. Let's go see that back again. There we go, mate. You alright, mate? Yeah, no, man. We're getting there. Fucking tough, mate. It's not been a good day, man. Think of the end, for man. Fucking hell. No, I'm trying, man. Had a bit of a breakdown, early. No wonder. I think I'm gonna fail Jacob, yeah. You're not gonna fail anyone. <laughs> a lot of steps, mate. We'll walk you in. You'll be sucking me by the time we <laughs> <start>. <laughs> I don't know, feeling a second win now, so... Honestly, see, just as that lorry goes round, Aye. we've got a double corner, and then you'll see the bridge. Yeah. And then that'll give you a wee... That will help, yeah. ...a wee boost. One foot in front of the other yeah. for another couple of miles, mate. What's the hardest f***ing part? I know, that's what's f***ing pissing me oh, off. We'll use it. Be pissed we've off. We've got five miles left, man. Yeah. Mate, if I can walk five miles just normally... Yeah. <laughs> Like, yeah, you probably weigh more than me right now. <laughs> Emotional. <sighs> I've got to put it off. Oh, you f***ing bastard. That's hard, mate. Good luck. Thank you, mate. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Thank you, mate. Thank 
come on. Are you doing it with him? Well, I'll do the last few miles with him, yeah. yeah. Seven stop, I gave him 20 quid. So whoever whoever gave Jordan Milligan that 20 quid for the charity, that's absolutely amazing, that's class. That makes it all the worthwhile, so. <sighs> Still there. Drink the rain, become the world's strongest marathon person. I don't know about Jordan, I'm pretty tired. Like. Not easy, mate. How many hours have you been going? Um, well, he started at midnight, so... Like, what, 16 and a half now? So, not bad. What have you eaten today? I've eaten like a little protein thing and that's about it. <laughs> My year, I got another yeah. one. Oh, no, What's been the highlight? The highlight, honestly, you guys turning up. Oh, yeah, I was. I was in a really bad place, man. Uh, my brother will tell you, like, it kind of looked mission over. And then the Calvary arrived, and I don't know what it is, but something changed, and we've made it. So, yeah, best moment by far. And I've got, trust me, you will survive on the back of Luke's shoe. I don't know if he wore it on purpose, but I tell you what, there's some message to uh, get me motivated. Been training for six months, and... Uh, Every training sessions, it was always max effort and very painful. So to finally be done with the the heavy stone portion. I mean, I still got 450 miles to go, but this stone is is done with now, and I'll get it back to my son in Nottingham. And yeah, I'll be proud of myself, man. I hope I kind of had this image of him in my head watching me and thinking like, wow, my dad's gone to some extreme lengths there. So yeah, it's got, it's got me. Got me motivated, got me through it at times, and uh, hopefully we'll, uh, I'll pull it off as well. Yeah. Here we are. Two miles. Last one. No. Hey. 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 We're not done yet. Are you alright? Pass me back, mate. You look a bit sunburned. Good. Squatch down. That's sick about, mate. I do. I do. <sighs> You're literally burned. I, think you're burned. I am, yeah. I've been in the sun for a while, mate. Right, you still eat chili there? Yeah, the tan. Are you a racist? Sorry. Stop <laughs> 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 At least it's done. <laughs> <laughs> 